Hello everyone, hope you're having a great Monday. Thank you for joining us for another race in the CSBS. We head to Buffalo Hill this week. Now a quick look back at Tilk Sport. Very happy with that P3. Uh, Gianna Bruzzi getting the win and Busher P2. With a dirt heavy season for this race team, we don't do very well in the dirt. At least we definitely know we don't do well interstate. So any, any kind of great performance we can get on a, a dirt heavy schedule is fine by us. Now heading into this race two, just so you're not confused when we start off. I noticed some settings were incorrect. So race officials announced to the drivers before the race that there will be no qualifying the rest of the season. It's gonna be reverse grids based off the points. So uh, unfortunately for Bruzy, looked like she was gonna be the hot hand this season. She's gonna to have to work her way through the crowd each week if she wants to stay on top. Same for Busher as, and us as well. So uh, keep an eye on that. Unfortunate, but everyone's in the same boat. Let's get out there and see what happens. All right, so I totally set the settings wrong up. Uh, so apparently it's reverse grid now. So this season is going to be a little different. No qualifying each race. We're, oh my goodness, Rosa. What did you do? All right, luckily we're only down to 93. Uh, so this might hurt Baruzzi's chances at the title, honestly. Because usually whoever's hot that season gets to start out front each race. This is going to make whoever is hot have to fight their way through the field every single week. So uh, this is going to be tough. This is going to be tough for everybody, myself included. Oh, no. Oh, we got on that outside dirt. That stuff seems to be a little bit more slippery than the actual racing surface. I'm not paying enough attention. I need to focus a little bit. Now we're back here with Torres and Espinoza. Espinoza having some trouble on that turn one. I forgot to look where she finished the first race. I'm sure my recap had that information for you. But she is the defending champion. And we have two laps down in this race and we're still sitting 12th. So we need to get going if we want to salvage some points out of this. Luckily, everybody else that's going to be contending for the title is also fighting their way through the field. It's not an easy thing to do in Circuit Superstars. That's why we call this the Banger Series. There's a lot of beating and banging. And the lead pack is getting farther and farther away from us, so we need to do some work. If you didn't see our first look video, this is the most recent release, least uh, release track. Came in the 0 0.3 update in early access. And it's pretty awesome, not gonna lie. Oh man, Pusher. We were getting into it with Pusher. Tomo Muzuhashi has like the opposite of our color scheme. I actually kind of like his better. I wish I went that direction than this one, but at least we look different. Okay, Tomo. He uh, doesn't appreciate the similar color scheme, apparently. Just put us in the wall. That's nice. Some awesome damage for us there. We're going to have to pay attention to the AI's pitting as well. See if we have to do that double pit again. There you go, Tomo. A little bit back at you. I really don't have an issue with Mizuhashi. I wonder why they're getting feisty with us. All right, now we have some damage. We're down in the 72. That is not optimal. We're going to be down pretty far in horsepower. And uh, we're going to be lucky if we salvage a podium here. Man, oh man, I wish I could set the qualifying correct. We're gonna, whoever is leading the points is literally gonna have to battle through the field every week. I don't know if it's reverse points or reverse the previous race, but we'll see what happens. We got 23 fuel, 43 tire. We're gonna pit the next time by. Honestly, it would have been probably good to go for the undercut there, get our, our car fixed up. But I'd rather get midway through, just in case the AI isn't going to pit two times. We can pull the one-stopper if needed. Yeah, we just don't have the horsepower now. We're down on damage. It's 68 now. Let's get in those pits. Oh, boy. There we go. Oh, 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 no, I missed the pit. Come on, come on, come on, guys. Full health, tires, and fuel. Let's go. Bad pit stop on my part. This, pit, stop, this uh, pit lane is pretty interesting because I think it's one of the only curved ones. Of course, I know the exits and entrances are curved, but I think it's one of the only curved ones for the actual pit boxes, which is 
kind of a neat little twist there, hitting wise. Add some, add some difficulty for sure. All right, Mizuhashi. Please don't put us in the wall. Okay. All over the back bumper, and we make a pretty clean pass. Honestly, I think that was pretty good. I'll take it. We got a nice pack here. We could probably get a few spots in like one swoop if they're all battling each other. I just got to put down some nice laps. Oh, that was the best turn we've had over there. I feel like we've run wide multiple times. We got damage over here we got to deal with. These, these cars have been going at it. You can see the battle scars already. Rose Espinosa having a rough day. Oh, spun the tires. Getting in the quarter pound on Rosa. Please don't take us up too wide. Oh my goodness. Rosa, get out of the way. Oh, don't you put us in the grass. Crossover. Sorry. Hey, we made that. We made it out of that with only 99 health. We lost one point. I will take it. Down. We're 11 laps in. Got some spots to make up. Oh, let me get past Radu pretty good. Up to nine. We got the inside. That's a good run. See a Belkusum. Get this inside line for this turn. Perfect. And next up is Torres. This section is tough right here. This is a, uh, you always kind of want to go for the pass there, but it's just not safe enough. You're going to either wreck your, both of you or you're just going to wreck yourself. Oh, I didn't take that turn very nicely, but we got through. Now up to P7. And I think we have some ground to make up if we want to do anything else. Have to keep an eye on those leaders too. I see some more pits going on. So I think we're going to have to force ourselves to pit again. Honestly, this might not be a force pit. We're down to 33 fuel. We might not have had enough anyway. So I think we're going to pit this time by, get some fresh tires. Oh, man. Baruzzi is... All right. Baruzzi is speed demon. That is not what we want to see. We got run over by Baruzzi. Just threw us off our game there. Let's get in these pits. Let's get tested those tires let's get fixed get off the wall oh my goodness radu okay all right we didn't miss the pit what a sequence of events there that last lap all right we don't need all the fuel 79 fuel that's quite enough yeah leaving early we just got in front of radu they're pushing what oh we had the spot and they ghost they unghosted inside of us and we got a track limits penalty for that. Everything going wrong. Oh, man. This is dire straits here. We need to salvage as many points as we can. We're sitting 11th position. Only two laps left. There's spots to gain. Goodbye, Radu. That was BS that you even got that spot from us earlier. Man, that wrecked us. We probably could have moved up to at least fifth. I think. I don't know. It's hard for me to check the dots right now. I tried looking, and that's what happens. I just got to put my head down try to make up as much spot. Let's see who's up there. We might be able to get two more spots. I don't know. It's the last lap. Not like this we won't. Driving like an idiot. There we go. Nice turn there. Let's see how much space we can make up. On the tarmac. Get a straight run. Don't even hit the wheel. Oh, I turned in a little too early. That's going to do it. Well, we're going to finish P9. That was... A lot of things went wrong there. There's a lot to unwrap there. Well, that was a sloppy race. Uh, right from the start, we just got taken out by Espinoza who hit the tire barrier and, and turn one uh, and then it was just kind of an up and down race from there we we had some good moments working our way through the field especially later in that race around maybe lap 11 or 12 I felt like we were really working our way through I don't know if we were 
out racing people on older tires or what but uh we were picking up spots left and right and then some some sloppy mistakes on my part and also just getting run off the road at certain areas from the other drivers unfortunately we had to just take our medicine and uh finish with a p9 so it's it's not last place we salvaged some points but it definitely uh definitely hurt the the two top drivers Baruzzi and busher both have wins this season they've jumped ahead pretty good but if you looked at three four and five in the standings where we are uh, we're all only separated by two points so we're not doing too bad in terms of the overall standings and a long season to go we head to magdalena next week uh, unfortunately without the the poles that means we can't get an extra point we can't get ahead of the the uh the field we have we're gonna have to fight our way through each week we're gonna be mid-pack on the grid next time so uh usually I, I try to like to get ahead of all the busyness of the ai drivers and the qualifying but uh we're not gonna have that crutch this season so we're gonna have to do what we can do uh everyone's in the same boat so uh Baruzzi and bush are gonna be starting at the rear of the field let's see if we can at least try to stay ahead of them next time by but hope you enjoyed the race. That was definitely a, a wild one for sure. And until next time, peace out.